Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to You Left Me. Now this is a serious game about a serious topic. That doesn't mean that it's not gonna have laughs, that doesn't mean that it's not gonna have interesting moments, but I've just been told that this game is relatively serious. So, we're gonna get right into it and move right along. It's one of those games where you go through, learn the story, and there's multiple endings to it. So, we gotta wake up. Hello? Ah, uh, oh. Work. Wake up, work, sleep. Wake up. Oh, the next day. I wake up in the same bed, but a different world. Where am I? Why am I here? I don't know. Nice guy. Oh. Nice, okay. Sounds like I'm underwater. Oh. Oh! On the moon clicks a 12-hour timer. What happens when night falls? When time runs up? How do I get out of here before then? I do Why am I in a hand? Oh. Okay. Hey, kitty. Oh, you gave me this cat. I love him like you had. Around him, I feel comfortable. No need to pretend. Yeah! Something doesn't seem right. Maybe it's the big glowing eye in the middle of his face. But I can't remember how he looks up close. I haven't spent time with him. Not since... Oh. I would talk to him. Hello, uh... Moo? What did I name my cat? I've had him for a while now, yet I can't remember. Senior <laughs> Waff- Doggo! Senior Waffles is good, but I gotta go with Doggo. Hey, Doggo the cat! <laughs> Hey, kitty, catty, doggo, wago, how you doing? I'm pretty proud of that one, thought of it myself. I did. Hey, doggo, you pee everywhere, but I love you anyway. Moo Moo Bork, my dude. <laughs> my dude, you're awake. Good snug last night. Oh, all right. How do I get out of here? Meow? This isn't normal, I don't belong here. Is that bad? Normal isn't always a good thing, you know? Aw, Pat. Bork, bork, blorf, bork. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, scratch, scratch. Boof, burfus, tabadoof. I will marry you platonically. I love you. I thank you. Alright, I'll leave you to sleep now. Yip, rough. Yes, mom, I stand. <laughs> you make me happy. Nay, I heart. I heart you too. Oh. Moo 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 hee haw. You're leaving already? Okay, love you. Please come back soon for purrs and snugs. Alright. Love you too. Oh. Okay, it's now 844. What does that mean? My phone. Unseen texts, missed calls. I rarely look at my phone anymore. I try to forget about the memories it contains. How does the pancake wobble? Read notes. Hmm. Ah. White messages read. Okay. They read. They read. I'm trying, but I can't read them. I see words, but I don't understand what they mean. Uh, try again. I. It, I don't know what's going on. I feel like my mind is working against me. I can't focus. I can't stop thinking about horrible things. I feel like I'm going crazy. I'm not scared of failure! Try again. That's me. That is me. After a few attempts, I get it. Oh. Okay. How does the pancake wobble, the magnets ask? The first sticky note reads, Daily reminder, I love you! From you know who, not the Harry Potter kind. The second note reads, Reads. Remember Swain's Lane. Why? The third note reads, give this girl some milk. All right, that's enough fridging, I guess. It's still 844, so I guess I could look inside the fridge. I'm positive there's nothing. Look anyway! I find my keys in the freezer. I thought I'd put them in my pocket. How'd they get there? Did I put them there? I need to get my memory checked. I don't know how you do that, but okay. All right, I guess that's enough for today. Uh clock the moon rumbles that's not something that the moon should do 
Just thinking, thunkling about it. How about myself? Get out of bed. Oh. Oh, I'm on a rocket ship to space. Where do I go? I need to escape this world before time runs out. Ah. What's going on outside? I hadn't noticed before now. Every okay. Every day the bus passes the same flower field. You would have liked this. I wish I could show this to you. All right. The flowers are gorgeous. I never learned to appreciate small things like these until you came along. The flowers are gorgeous. I never learned to... Okay, all right, read that. Okay. Let's go to Swain's Lane. I remembered that. Swain's Low. I remember now. You died a while ago, and I've been denying it since. But you wouldn't want that, would you? Me, stuck in my head, living a fantasy. And there's so much more of reality to explore. The cat you left me. The flower fields that pass the metro. Oh. I loved you, you know. You left me behind. I don't blame you for leaving. Every day, I wake up and think about joining you. Oh, that's heavy. There's only one choice for me. There's no giving in. And it's just, that's just a hard, fast rule. It's something that is completely against my character, but it's tough. Uh, but I'll keep a living with the memories you gifted me. Without you. I think that's one of the endings. Yeah. Dedicate to everyone who's lost anyone. Thanks for playing. That was so short. That was so sweet. Oh. But that's not the only ending. That's not the only ending. Oh, man. That's tough. It always is losing someone. Especially if it was someone that close to you. But let's explore the game a little further and then I'll make some judgments toward the end of it. Get out of bed. Oh, the flowers are still there. That's weird. I can't even go to Swain's Lane. Let's go anywhere. I'll go anywhere. I don't care where. As long as it's far away from home. Hours pass. I don't know where I am. I don't know why I'm here. We used to have fun taking the metro together and leaving at random stops. Without you, there is no fun. Without you, repeating old memories just makes me feel lost. By the end of the adventure, I feel like I left a little of my soul to every place I visited. The park, a hill, inside rooms, outside buildings, noisy streets, soft-spoken alleys. Night finally falls. When I get back on the bus to head home, no one's there. The loneliness is suffocating. Mm. Oh, no. oh. Two sides of an unfair coin, live and die. Those are two of the five endings. More of a succinct, abrupt end to that story. So there's got to be like, apparently it seems like a lot of it has to do with where you go in, uh, in the world, but maybe it has something to do with like the other interactions that you have. Not that you have a lot. Let's go to work. Oh no. Oh god, it's the crushing monotony of an Amazon fulfillment center. Oh no. <laughs> Do I get to interact with this? No, I guess I don't. Alright, roof. Oh, oh no. Oh.
Maybe those are the only like two endings, just the circumstances are different. You live or you die. Hmm. But in this one in particular, the, the living one is remembering. I'm, I'm honestly kind of curious. I, I know it's probably not terribly good, but there must have been a reason to get like the keys. The phone doesn't work right now. Let me try talking to the kitty, getting that all sorted. All right, so we talk to the kitty. You make me happy. Love you too. Let's see about the phone. Huh, I still can't look at the phone. I don't know why. I just can't look at the phone anymore. That's weird. Oh, I can't go to Swain's Lane either. I wonder why. It's kind of disabled now. Let's go to the clinic. Uh, observe. The doctors always look so happy with what they're doing. It makes it that much easier to spill every thought you have to them. But I can't tell the truth. I don't know how. How can I when I don't want to remember? Wait in line. I wait for a very long time. Just as I was beginning to lose hope, they finally called my name. Sorry about the wait. Our latest experiment in happiness didn't go quite as well as planned, so I had to do some crisis intervention. Enough about me. What can I do for you today? Let's see. How do I get out of this world? Excuse me? Can you repeat that? How do I get out of this world? Sorry, I'm not trained to help you with that. Oh. Signs of psychosis. Possible insanity. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just taking notes. Did you need anything else? My mask is cracking. It looks fine to me. Can I try something else instead? Let me see. Would you like to try our newly patented happy pills? One day we'll keep the sadness at bay. Sounds great, thank you. Of course. Let us know about your experience. We'll see you around. Alright, I guess go home. Huh. Home? I guess I can go to Swain's Lane now, which is weird. Still can't read that. Take happy pills. I want to forget about bad thoughts, so that I'm only filled with the good. With every pill, I feel myself lose grip of reality a little more. Remember a little less. I need to forget it all. To forget it all. I'll take it all. I'm sorry. That's rough. This is all rough. I mean, the thing about this is, it's it's a story about something that's not inherently good. Like, the, th the thing about this game and the thing about the content that it's trying to talk about is that it's not a good situation. Like, there's no right answer about, like, how to get to a point where you can rationalize it or you can you can understand it it's it's about accepting something that's completely out of your control which is something that no one likes no one no one wants to do i mean i've lost people and i've known people that have lost more than i have and many many have lost more than i have but you know oh that's so weird wait i still have my happy pills Wait, is this all persistent? That's why the flowers were still there. That's why I can't look at my phone anymore. I talked to the moon. Wonder if there's... The moon has new jokes every once in a while. I know it's been hard. What's loud and sounds like an apple? An apple! I know you want to give up. What class did Karl Marx struggle with the most? The bourgeois. What's brown and rhymes with Snoop? Dr. Dre. Do you feel alone? What do you call a dog that does magic tricks? A labracadabrador. I didn't mean to leave you. What word would mean a lot to you right now? Plethora. What's the difference between a well-dressed man on a unicycle and a poorly dressed man on a bike? A tire. Yeah. What did you forget? Who did you forget? What happened to them? The moon is silent. Child, you're relentless. You have tired me. I need a nap. What are the humans feeding their offspring these days? Tide pods, was it? The moon is napping peacefully. 
Oh, I guess napping peacefully. Let's go back to work and then let's go home when we're done. Talk? Do I have to socialize like a full functioning human? Yesterday you said <laughs> Oh boy, uh, oh, hey, hey, how's it going? Oh, hey, what's up? Why are you at work today? Socializing, uh, why do you ask? I mean, I just, why are you here? You've been taking this day off for weeks now, ever since, uh, I mean, yeah. Anyway, why are you here? I just wanted to. You wanted to? You okay? You right in the head? Let's see. Well, I'm fine, why do you ask? I really think you should talk to someone. Bottling up emotions just doesn't, you know. Let's see. What do you mean by that? I mean, you've been to our gates, right? Um, yes? Uh, oh, okay. Well, I just want to say I can go with you if you go. I know from experience that the first time is the scariest. Is that a challenge? Oh boy, not one I can beat. I'm glad I talked to you. We rarely talk. We need to change that. Hmm. Don't feel any better for it. Report! Oh, 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 ah, oh, okay, hi. Oh boy. Hello? All right. And a decent job as always. Of course, there's always room for improvement. Hey, what do you say about working late tonight? <laughs> you can improve and I can give you closer feedback. I don't want to improve packaging boxes. This is a great opportunity for you. Trust me on this. Uh, no thanks. You sure? You, me, alone? <laughs> is coercing legal? Uh. I don't know how I got him off my back, but I did. Just another long, long day. All right, go home, I guess. Swan Lane. I remember now. I've been here before. Yeah, I have. Every day I wake up and think about joining you. I think I get the point of this game and why it's persistent. Because the point is, and the reason that it's persistent is that it's an everyday battle. Like, it's it's a desire to fight every day. You don't just wake up one day and be like, I accept it. I'm done. I'm over it. I, I, I'm good. I'm, I'm stronger than that. I feel strong about it. Like, that's not what it's about. Like, loss stays with you for your entire life. Like, it can heal and you'll be fine and you'll, you'll be better for it, but you'll always remember it. And like, the temptation to give in is always gonna be there. And it'll always pull you back. But that's why you gotta stay strong, cause, you know, you survive one day, you can survive more. And you can keep going, and then you can keep living, even if it can't seem like you will. I know it's hard, and I'm not the best person to give advice about this, but I knew that this game was going to be serious, and I knew that it was going to tackle some pretty heavy topics of death. But, if there's one thing I know, and there's one thing that I said at the beginning of this video, is that it's not in my nature to ever give in. And I could hit this button and, you know, I would see, like, I would see another ending that I haven't been, seen before. But for me personally, I'm never going to hit that button. Not ever. So I'm gonna choose to survive again. But I'll keep living with the memories you gifted me without you. Yeah. And it's tough. It really is. It's really tough. There's nothing that I can say or do that makes it easier, and there's no advice that I could give any of you who are going through loss right now. But just know that it does get easier. It really does. And it's not easier because you forget how important they were to you. It's easier because you appreciate all the good times that you shared together. And you appreciate all the memories that you have. I mean, this game articulates it very well. Like, you remember the things that they leave behind. And you remember the lessons that they taught you. And the, the moments that you shared and the laughs that they gave you. Even the frustrating times, you know, the bad times. You remember those too. And that's not a bad thing. Because that's literally what life is all about. It's about good, it's about bad. It's about sharing experiences with other people. And that never ends until it does. And you don't know when it's gonna happen, you don't know if it's gonna happen. Well, I mean, we all know it's definitely gonna happen, but you don't know when, so. 
The only advice I can give is to do as much as you can for the people around you, for those that you love, to spread as much joy as possible. And don't, like, admonish yourself for any bad times that do happen. But do learn to forgive both others and yourself when you can. So anyway, I'll leave this one here. If you want to see what that ending is, I'll leave a link to this game in the description below. But just, I know, given the subject that this is, I literally can't press that button. I hope you understand that about me. I, I just can't, because it's not in my nature. I, I've, I've learned a lot about myself over the years that I've been an adult, and uh, part of that comes with you know, a lot of life lessons that I didn't choose to experience, but did anyway, so... Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you are going through any pain right now, uh, reach out to someone else in the community who has gone through the same thing. There's tons of people out there and there's huge support groups out there that are ready to talk about it and help you and help you through things like loss and pain and depression. So just reach out where you can and know that if you are not going through that and you see someone reaching out for help, why don't you send them some positivity and just send them an encouraging message. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Let me know what you thought down in the comments. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!